have some breaking news in the Jets universe right here. Let's talk about it. What's going on, everybody? I am Jack Talks Jets. Welcome back to another video. Thank you, guys. First of all, I want to thank you guys all for 200 subscribers. I could not have done it without you guys. And, you know, it's been my dream to become a sports broadcaster, and it looks like it is becoming true. So thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers. I really appreciate it. So now let's get into the video. Okay, so today's first topic is, of course, and probably our only topic today is... The Jets hiring Nathaniel Hackett as their next offensive coordinator. I think this is a very good move by Robert Sala, Joe Douglas, Woody Johnson. I think this is a very good move. Although Hackett may have not have been the best offense or, or head coach, he was a great offensive coordinator. He was the offensive coordinator for the Jaguars from 2016 to 2018 with Blake Bortles. And... He was the off, he was the offensive coordinator for the Green Bay Packers from 2019 to 2021 with Aaron Rodgers and you know we also our topic was Aaron Rodgers last video and you know if since we hired Hackett I, I some people on Sports Center are saying we just hired Hackett to get Aaron Rodgers and I, I could kind of see that but in a way I don't because the Jets fired Mike Lafleur to get a better play caller and Hackett's a great play caller. I think we hired him for a reason. One, to bring a better culture here in New York, uh, which it already was a better culture, but to bring better offensive, you know, magic to the team. And two, I think we hired him also to get a connection with Aaron Rodgers. And I think we are one step closer to getting Aaron Rodgers as our quarterback. And I just actually saw on something posted by something, I think it was Fox NFL on Instagram, something about one of the... Um, NFL Network channels. They said the Jets are most likely to either get Derek Carr or Aaron Rodgers. And I am so excited. I cannot wait to see what quarterback we get for 2023. I've never been, I, I've honestly never been this excited for a quarterback before. And especially because Woody Johnson and the Jets organization said they're looking for a veteran. They're not looking to draft a quarterback this year. They're looking for a veteran quarterback. And so next video, actually, I'm going to go off topic for a quick sec. Next video, I might actually do a draft video. Or a free agency video. I might do both. So I'm probably going to do a draft video next. To see. I, I might do a quick mock draft. Um, but this video is focusing on Nathaniel Hackett. Now. Again with Hackett. Um, being close with Aaron Rodgers. In case of you know a quarterback offensive coordinator. I think we're. Like I said. I think we're one step closer to getting Aaron Rodgers. I think he's a very good prospect. For this team. And. Um. Hackett even coached him from for three seasons, I think. So I think he has a really good chance. So um, Hackett, I think, is a really good move for the New York Jets. And I feel like he'll just be a better, a really good play caller in a way. I feel like he'll develop the quarterback. I feel like he'll develop the play calling, you know, because, of course, he will. Now, what do I think of this Nathaniel Hackett hiring? I think it's pretty good. Um, you know, not better... Uh, I think he might do a better job than Mike LaFleur did with us. He did, Mike LaFleur did good his first season, but his first season, his second season started off pretty good, started off 7-4, and four. not bad. I didn't honestly see, I honestly saw Mike LaFleur at least being there for the next two seasons for the New York Jets. I didn't really see him getting fired at all after the season, but unfortunately he did. Um, but we got Nathaniel Hackett, which is a really good, which is really good. Our other, uh, I was actually going to do, um... Excuse me. So speaking of offensive coordinator, I was actually going to do an offensive coordinator video, but instead the next day I got the notification um, on my phone. It said, "Breaking news: The New York Jets have uh, hired former Broncos head coach Nathaniel Hackett to be their next offensive coordinator." And I was shocked because I had this, I had a, a whole video planned out. See, if we we're gonna uh, hire Frank Reich, uh, hire Cliff Kingsbury, hire Nathaniel Hackett as our as our um, offensive coordinator, and my top prospect was Nathaniel Hackett, and hey, we, we got him, so I, I was kind of right, I was uh, telling some of my friends that we were going to get Nathaniel Hackett, and there we go, we got him, so, um, like I said, I think Hackett's a really good prospect for, for many reasons, and I just give you guys a lot of the answers for it, so, anyways, Hackett is kind of special, in a way, let's talk about this real quick, 
Hackett brought a good culture to Green Bay. He brought them to the NFC Championship twice. Brought them to the playoffs three times, all three seasons that he coached there. Um, and, you know, just in all hall, he's a, he was a pretty good offensive coordinator there. And he even brought the Jacksonville Jaguars to the AFC Championship in 2017. I mean, to go to the conference championship four or three times, that's... That's amazing. I mean, especially with two different teams, he went to the ja he went to the conference championship with the Jaguars once, and with the Packers twice. That's amazing. And I even um, saw Stephen A. Smith on SportsCenter say, if the Jets get Aaron Rodgers, they could go all the way. I completely agree. The Jets are a talented team. They just pulled together. Their defense is doing great. We just have to extend Quincy Williams, extend Quinny Williams, maybe extend C.J. Mosley. We'll see. We'll talk about that in another video. But we have to get Aaron Rodgers. I think we have to get Aaron Rodgers or Derek Carr or Lamar Jackson. Lamar Jackson is pretty unlikely now because John Harbaugh did say he's looking to be for him to become a Raven next year. He's trying everything he can for Jackson to become a Raven next season. But I still have some hope. The quarterback I want the most, however, right now is Aaron Rodgers. And then my second one that I want right now is Derek Carr and Lamar Jackson. So, anyways, thank you guys. Oh, before I go, I actually want to tell you guys something. Uh, like I said, I was going to do a video about the offensive coordinators, but then Frank Reich got hired by the Panthers. I didn't see that happening. I don't. I, I, could, I could, actually, now that I think about it. But I didn't see them hiring Frank Reich. Um, I, I, had, I, I had Cliff Kingsbury in mind. Um, you know, kind of... I, had, I was kind of picturing Cliff Kingsbury for the Carolina Panthers. I wasn't really picturing um, um, Frank Reich that much, but... Anyway, guys, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button. And if you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. We just hit 200. Thank you guys so much. Peace out, Jet fans.